In this video, we'll look at the Lewis structure for diatomic hydrogen. You'll also hear this called molecular hydrogen, or perhaps more commonly, just hydrogen gas. So this is our H2 here. To write the Lewis structure, the first thing we need to do is figure out how many valence electrons we have for H2. If we look at the periodic table organized by the number of valence electrons in each group, group one, where we have hydrogen, all of these have one valence electron. So here's our hydrogen, one valence electron. We have two hydrogen atoms, so we're going to multiply that by two. We have a total of two valence electrons for the H2 Lewis structure. First, we'll write the element symbols for hydrogen. We have two hydrogens. Next, we'll place a pair of electrons between these two hydrogen atoms to form a chemical bond. And at this point, we've used all of our valence electrons. We only have two. Hydrogen only needs two valence electrons to have a full outer shell. So in this case, this hydrogen right here, it has a full outer shell. It has two valence electrons. And this hydrogen here, it has two valence electrons. So by sharing these electrons, we end up with this Lewis structure for H2, diatomic hydrogen, also called molecular hydrogen or just hydrogen gas. We could replace this pair of electrons here with a line. And this line right here, this would represent a single bond, a pair of electrons shared between the hydrogens. So that's the Lewis structure for diatomic hydrogen, also called molecular hydrogen or just hydrogen gas. This is Dr. V, and thanks for watching.